Today, I'm gonna to talk about what makes our program truly transformational for our students, and that's a foundation built on research. At the Windward School, we are deeply committed to the science of reading. This is a body of scientifically based research in reading that has been conducted across multiple disciplines over decades. And it informs our evidence-based instructional practices and interventions for students who struggle with reading. Wimber's reading program focuses on the five pillars of reading identified in the National Reading Panel, which looked at over 100,000 studies. And those areas include phonemic awareness, phonics, fluency, vocabulary, and comprehension. Wimber's reading program has also been grounded in decades of research that point to the efficacy of direct, explicit, and sequential reading instruction. We have had countless cohorts of students whose academic successes have proven that Wimward's methodologies work. The Wimward School is a leader in the remediation of language-based learning disabilities and was deliberately selected by the Haskins Global Literacy Hub for its in-school neuroscience program with leading experts in the field of educational neuroscience. The study, which is part of the Wimward School and Haskins Laboratory Collaborative Project, is called Predicting Literacy Outcomes of the Wimward School, or PLOW for short. This in-school study enables the Wimward School and the Wimward Institute to also be active contributors to the research efforts on the science of reading. PLOW is a multi-year study led by researchers at the Haskins Laboratory, focused on reading and evidence-based instruction. The study follows participants as they progress through their education here at the Wimward School. The goal is to gather clear data on the ways in which reading skills change over time as students experience the benefits of an evidence-based instructional program. This will enable us to learn more about brain-based mechanisms involved in students' responses to targeted reading interventions. Ultimately, the study hopes to improve early diagnosis and remediation of language-based learning disabilities, and use translational science to improve classroom instructional practices for increased reading gains. Participating Wimber students are referred to as junior scientists. With the permission of their families, they volunteer for the program and work with Haskins scientists in one of Wimber's state-of-the-art mobile labs. Our junior scientists have been enthusiastic about participating in their cognitive and reading assessments. They experience science research in action and enjoy learning more about their brains and seeing their brain waves at work. The study utilizes two types of activities. An electrocephalography, otherwise known as an EEG machine, is used to collect a child's brain frequencies as they respond to reading-based tasks. EEG neuroimaging is a non-invasive brain imaging technology and the data collected provides a window into how brains understand and complete different types of reading tasks. Students also complete behavioral assessments that measure reading skills such as letter recognition skills, coding, and listening and reading comprehension. The research study highlights the connection between EEG data and behavioral measures and how these data points have the ability to show reading changes over the PLOW study at the Windward School has enabled scientists to conduct research in an authentic educational setting. This study is contributing to scientific data that shows brains continue to change over time with targeted evidence-based reading instruction. Our brains were not born naturally to read, rather they changed as they gained reading skills. Our families and teachers know that with reading instruction based on proven methods, students acquire reading success. In summary, it is clear that interest has grown in translational science over the last decade, and Wimbledon is at the forefront of this work with this partnership and study. Translational science improves bi-directional communication among experts in science and in experts in education, making it possible for leaders in various disciplines to learn from one another. Wimbledon is deeply committed to growing the evidence that informs the science of reading and, in doing so, leading the way in remediating language-based learning disabilities and promoting evidence-based instruction for all children.